how to get a mortgage without two years tax returns coming up. Hey guys, I'm Adam Lesnar and my oxygen is getting borrowers approved for a mortgage when other lenders say that it's just not possible. Today we're diving straight into how to get approved without providing two years of tax returns. We have six options that we're going to dive into. So let's just jump right into it. Hey guys, a quick favor before we get started, if you could please subscribe so that we can help more people every single week. Thanks so much. Let's jump right into it. When applying for a mortgage, lenders typically require two years of tax returns as proof of income and employment. This standard requirement can make Make it difficult for certain borrowers to qualify, such as self-employed individuals, those with gaps in employment, or those who haven't filed tax returns for past two years. If you find yourself in a situation where you cannot provide the standard two years of tax returns, don't lose hope. There are still options available to help you secure a mortgage. Here's what you need to know about getting a mortgage without having to provide two years of tax returns. Traditional mortgage without two years of tax returns. I'm going to be crystal clear. If you're not self-employed or work for family or have rental properties, you don't need to provide tax returns to get a mortgage if you're a W-2 employee. The problem is most lenders require tax returns by default. The result is many borrowers are denied by those lenders unnecessarily due to the write-offs or years not filed. If you're a W-2 employee looking to get approved without tax returns, we're more than happy to help. But if you have a more of a unique income situation, let's dive into the options available for you now. Alternative documentation for getting a mortgage without two years of tax returns. Lender's main concern is verifying that you have a stable and sufficient income or assets to make your mortgage payments. If you cannot provide tax returns, you'll need to provide alternative documentation to prove your ability to repay the loan. This route is most commonly used by business owners and real estate investors. Let's look at the different options available. Bank statement loan. With a bank statement loan, you do not provide any tax returns. This is a great option option if you're self-employed or a private contractor. You'll provide 12 to 24 months of personal or business statements as proof of income. Your bank statements will be carefully reviewed to determine an average monthly income. You will also provide a basic business narrative to give underwriting clarity on your business structure. More on bank statement loans, I'll include a link below in the description so you have everything that you need to know about bank statement loans. Profit and loss statement or a P&L loan. If you're self-employed, you can provide a profit and loss statement from your business prepared by an accountant or tax professional. This should cover the past 12 months. This is a much more simple route to go than a bank statement loan if you have a CPA or a tax professional to help with providing a 12-month P&L. 1099 loan. For freelancers or independent contractors, you can provide 1099s from your clients or employers to document your income. Asset depletion loan. If you have significant assets such as investment or retirement accounts, these accounts can be used to determine your ability to repay the loan. For this product, you do not list any employer or income source on your application. The income piece of the mortgage approval is based on your liquid assets. DSCR investor cash flow loan. For real estate investors, DSCR loans use the rental income from your investment properties as the primary income source. Your ability to repay the loan is based on the fair market rent on the property. These are allowed on long-term rentals as well as short-term vacation rentals. When the appraisal is ordered, there'll be a 1007 rent schedule where the appraiser will give an opinion of fair market rent. Even if the property is in a negative cash flow position, or vacant, there still are options available. Seek professional assistance. Navigating the mortgage process without tax returns can be complex, so it's wise to seek assistance from a knowledgeable mortgage professional. An experienced loan officer can help guide you through the process, advise you on the best loan options for your situation, and help you gather the necessary documentation. In summary, here are the best six options available if you're looking to get approved for a mortgage without providing two years of tax returns. Traditional mortgage for W-2 employees. Bank statement loan for business owners and private contractors. Profit and loss loan for business owners. 1099 loan for private contractors. Asset depletion loan for high net worth individuals. And DSCR loans for real estate investors. While getting a mortgage without tax returns is certainly possible, it requires more effort and preparation. By understanding traditional mortgage options, exploring alternative income documentation options, and seeking professional assistance, you can improve your chances of securing a mortgage despite your unique financial situation. Thanks guys. Appreciate you stopping by. I hope that was helpful. As always, please, please, please feel free to drop a comment below with any questions that you have, anything that I didn't cover. If this video was helpful at all, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe so we can help more people every single week. Thanks guys. We'll see you next time.